hey guys welcome back to my channel and if you're new welcome so before i jump into my little story time i'm gonna give you some info on the wig that i'll be installing today so this wig is from super wigs this is their 13 by 60 part lace wig the color is a medium brown the lace color is a medium brown and the color of the hair itself is a highlight blonde which is one of my favorites it's a hundred percent human hair and the density is 150 percent so to style this wig i'm gonna put it on my little mannequin head that i need to throw away and replace and i'm just gonna try to lay all the hair is back with my pressing comb that i got from shein believe it or not it gets like really hot and yeah that's pretty much all i'm gonna do so for this little story y'all so i got with this guy some time ago i was out of school i wasn't in high school anymore so i was old enough just in case anybody was thinking or wondering so um, I got with this guy at that time. I was really into like Wanting to do modeling and stuff like that. And I don't remember how or where we met but we met and As usual like I, I don't really remember how I meet people I just know that I have certain people in my life where I had certain people in my life He was a photographer. So I was like, yeah, damn, okay I got me a little suit or whatever. I want, I'm trying to do my modeling. And you know, he's a photographer, like professional photographer or whatever. You can't look at somebody and say, okay, he's he 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 looked like he got stalker capabilities or she looked like she got stalker capabilities or crazy girlfriend capabilities or crazy boyfriend capabilities he was talking to me about like getting married to me and stuff and i'm like sir i'm in my prime right now i'm not thinking about that at all like let me be like <laughs> no so i was trying to you know get away from him a little like separate myself from him a little and like eventually just not talk to him at all so he was picking up that that's what i was doing and he started getting like really obsessive like even more obsessive because he's realizing that okay she's she's kind of ignoring me so he would call me like so many times in a day like so many times something about when i turn my phone back on it's like more than 30 missed calls like sir what's good move on it's not that deep like i understand with men they don't have much luck in dating and like if they want to get it in or what you know what i mean you know what i mean they're trying to do the do it's not a, as easy for them a, a girl can get a guy anytime but a guy can't get a girl anytime so i totally understand but still if a girl want to move on let her move on so this guy knew where i live and he knew where i live because growing up i was always told stop going to meet guys stop taking taxis and buses to go meet guys let them come pick you up at your gate but again you can be with somebody for a year and then they won't show you any signs of being a stalker or anything like that and then as soon as y'all break up they don't you, you want to leave them they don't want to leave you and then that's when shit gets dangerous so i remember i was standing on my gate and he was trying to call me on my phone and i saw him drive by he went down the street and went back up and i was like this dude is actually looking for me <laughs> i never like went to the police or anything like that because i was scared like you'll never know what someone is capable of and i just i wanted to take care of it on my own so i forgot to mention that he threatened me verbally um every time he sent me a voice message like uh leave me a voicemail he would say like he's gonna f me up and this and that and i'm like i don't understand why there's so much emotion in this because we weren't serious like that at all like it wasn't no serious relationship we were mostly friends if my memory serves me right and I, I didn't take anything from him i didn't take any money nothing at all from him it wasn't like a serious long relationship at all like i understand maybe 
he had a hard time getting girls and i don't know but then again we weren't serious so i don't understand recently he's, he messaged me he didn't message me but he commented on one of my stuff on facebook and i'm like dude it's been years why are you still obsessing over me so i blocked him he don't have my number um he don't have my facebook info anymore because i blocked him the only thing that for him to do is maybe come on my instagram or something but yeah that was it for this story time y'all be careful they're out to get us um i hope y'all enjoyed this video i hope you like the wig everything you need to know about it will be in the description down below and yeah i'll see you in the next one bye so again about the wig there's not a lot of um lace in the front so you can't do like no braids or anything like that in the front you only get the middle part and that's it so if you're the type of person who loves rocking middle parts and you don't mind not having that much lace then i definitely recommend this it looks super nice the knots are brown don't get it twisted they're brown so they will blend in nicely it's super affordable and yes i do recommend the hair is of a natural feel it's not too thin not too heavy it's just perfect so again everything you need to know about this wig will be in the description down below and thank you so much super wigs for sponsoring today's video